we all have great vibes going into this weekend and um, you know if we make it past this weekend it's going to be even great or even better next week so um, I don't really think the team differs too much I mean I think offensively we are seven huge powerhouse players um, middies are awesome and especially our defense we're all returning and, and cat returning too so um, I don't know I just, everyone's on the same page, we're super focused, and we all have one goal in mind. First half last on um, Sunday, we played really well, offensively and defensively. But more so on the offensive end, you know, we were a huge powerhouse. We were up eight to one at one point because we were playing our game. We were focused on what we were doing, and we didn't let any of the outside stuff kind of play into that. So just staying focused, you know, moving ball high, and finishing our shots. I think it definitely helps that we made it last year. We all kind of remember that feeling of you know, working hard to get to the final four, and we want nothing less than that. So, um, yeah, we're just super focused, we're ready to go, and just anxious to play on Sunday. Steph, I'm curious about kind of your connection with Madison, especially off, off the draw. How has that developed over the year? Um, you know, just like last year, she was a freshman, and I was actually the only returning attacker. So, um, just like building that connection early, and I mean, we're we're locker buddies, we're 24, 23, and, um, I don't know, just building a relationship off the field, I think, helps, too. Like, she's awesome on the field, off the field, obviously, but, um, I don't know, Matt's special. She's an amazing player, and she's always open. So, um, I don't know, she's just an easy target to hit. I'm also curious kind of a, about the composure that, that you all have developed this year. It seems like at, at no point during the JMU game were you guys super rattled. Um, how has that developed over the year? Um, I think just like confidence in each other and confidence in yourself as a player and even our coaches, um, just believing in what they say, like really investing in that and um, just having everybody on board um, I think has really been a huge factor for us. So it's been great this year. This team, we don't get, you know, rattled and it doesn't, one thing goes wrong and it's not like the end of the world. It's kind of like, and that goes with the leadership. I think because we're all pretty confident in ourselves personally and in each other, it, it helps with the composure because we're like you know one thing went wrong we're gonna learn from it move forward you know whatever and Missy always says the bounce back don't dwell on it you know whatever happens happens and you just learn and move forward and I think that's a huge thing with our composure that we've learned this year um, and just being confident in each other is so big for us. Missy talked a little bit about kind of taking some learning lessons especially defensively has there been anything that you've kind of been able to key in on and kind of help take more of a leadership role this week heading into this weekend um so I think one like big thing you know every week you learn something different and and every week you kind of focus on something new to make sure you're prepared for the next week and I think coming off of the JMU game and moving forward we really um just need to know that, you know, be on the whole game. Like, every moment, when you're in your moment, that's what you're going to do, you know. And, and defensively, when the ball's on offense, we get a little bit of a break. We can catch our breath, do that kind of thing. But as soon as the ball is coming down to us, that's when we're going to be on. We're not, you know, letting anything up or letting, letting our guard down, you know, for just more than 10 seconds because we are it's a 90 second maximum on our side of the field so then you get your break you know that kind of thing so it's really just working in your moment and making sure that we're all kind of we could say staying active and not just you know standing and waiting for the play to come to us it's kind of like making a play happen so I think that's something we've definitely we definitely are going to be pushing this week I have always said this program I've been here for five years so this program has grown um, like immensely you know in in every way and and every year has gotten better on the field off the field you know everything has really increased and I think um, I'm so proud to be at this point and that I think my freshman year we hit you know number 15 or something and that was like a huge thing and it was so exciting and it was so great and it's so amazing to be a part of you know every year we have set made a little stepping stone you know then we were probably around the 12 and then 10 and then 8 and you know whatever and we made it to the final four last year so it's really great to you know be a part of something and this whole team and Missy and the coaches Amy Brooke has done such a great job of moving us forward that I I you know want to continue that for the next couple weeks but it's really great to leave on such a great note and have such a great you know background of it so I think it's it's exciting to have our last game like Steph said it's a little bit sad you know a little teary but um, definitely exciting and definitely you know that we are hosting and that you know we're not playing this tournament and at somewhere else you know it's on our field on our turf and and that's definitely exciting to move forward and even more you know advantage.
Missy does this thing in practice where she says like game winner and I'm like super competitive and I'm like oh let's go like game winner like bring it and things like that and I think that is very like important to like how we've developed as a program because you see teams like you're down by one or you're up by one and they start to kind of lose it whereas like you know we turn it on we're like oh we need a score goal let's go like oh you think you're going to come down to score like let's see it like what are you going to throw at us like we're ready and I think that like is a huge part of our game and like what makes it fun and things like that so I think our players including myself have done a nice job of just like channeling that and being turning it not into something like oh we need to take care of the ball like we're scared or whatever it's like all right let's go like game time like this is what these are the moments that we practice for these are the moments that we want to play lacrosse that's why we're in the game those big plays that's what makes lacrosse fun having those moments in practice where that's kind of a little bit more stressful when it translates into a game you're not stressed about it